We're back, mate. We're back. Good to see ya. I can't see ya, but good to see ya. Hope you hope you're good. Hope you had a nice couple of days playing and practicing the drums and having fun, mate. That's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. I'm gonna today the plan of action is book in some one-to-one -one lessons if you want to do that reach out via the email below. Actually, actually, my Calendly link will be there. A book in, Zoom or in person. And a um, bit of practicing um, and then boxing. Wish me luck with that one. And then, yeah, go home and look at some shoes I want to buy on the internet that I can't afford. The perfect day, mate. The perfect day. Just want to do a little quick shout out to Sam Kochev. Um, sorry for mispronouncing that if I did, mate. Jack Woods, Caleb Parker, my man, Jordan Alexander, Moonquake, 1967. What a name. Joey Jams, C. Kelly Drums, Co. Joza, Fabian, uh, Matt Hyde, Hyde, David Horn, um, Spike T. Smith, Sam, InSync Drums, David Appenden, Sprawl, Ben Britton, um, Oscar, uh, Tom, Ray, Martin, and Marco, mate. They are some of the people who commented on the last video. And mate, I appreciate it, man. Those comments keep me going. Like, I see the comments and I'm like, yes! Honestly, mate, one of my true passions is just playing drums, obviously, but then talking about drums and also talking about the stuff that I think is important. Like, the stuff off the kit as well as on the kit. Like, we all have a cheeky chop. Do you know what I mean? But how we're th how we're thinking and how we're feeling is very very important on the kit and that's what i love to talk about man so thank you very much for tuning in i'm gonna hop over in the kit hop over on the kit in just a second before we move on i did just want to show you my little my new bad boy i know you heard it in the last video but oh mate <laughs> hang on hang on come on autofocus don't let me down here boy look at it mate look at it Flipping heck. Game changer, that. It's an absolute demon, man. It's a bit too high, I think. I don't know. I love it. That's me all over. A bit of snap, crackle, and pop. Just I, Everyone asks about tuning. How do I tune it? And, and to be honest with you, I don't know how. I just crank it until it sounds all right. And if it sounds too tight, I drop it a little bit. And if it sounds too loose, I bring it up. But honestly, man, it's like... I don't really know how to tune drums at all, to be honest with you. Like I, I kind of make it up as I go along. But um, but yeah, it's a bit too high for like busted, I think. You can't really be um, selfish when it comes to your snare tone when you're playing for like a band and especially when it's not your band. You know what I mean? You've got you've to gotta make the snare work for the music and, and then also work for the front of house guy. Even on the last tour, mate, the front of house guy was like, yeah, I need it a little bit, a little bit lower if you can, mate. He wanted it within like a within a certain hertz, within a range, basically a frequency range. And mine was just too high. Um, so we did, we did bring it down a little bit, but yeah, it's a bit too extreme for the busted thing. I think, I don't know, who knows, we'll give it a bash because I don't know if this would sound good. Detune a little bit with a clear head. I've never used one before. Um, low anyway. Um, but yeah, that's the, that's the snare drum, mate. It was in my local drum shop and Every time me and my son go in, it was just there in the back, just looking at me, just winking at me. Take me home, will ya? I said, go on then. <laughs> go on then, mate. I'll take you home. I'm looking forward to it. Let's hop over. Let's crank this, shall we? Ba -ding! Look at it, mate. <sighs> Have a little five minutes on the kit, figure out what I need to get better at, figure out if I can figure out some new ideas. Then boxing, then go home, then look at shoes I can't afford, and then maybe find a pink Vista Light kit. We'll see, mate. We'll see. But anyway, hope you're all good, mate, genuinely. And let me know down in the comments what you've been up to over the last few days. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for watching. Thank you for hitting the like button. And thank you to all the new subscribers, man. This year is the year that I'm just like, I felt, I felt like a dripping tap last year. I said this on the podcast with me and Mike, Mike Johnston, but um, drum with Mike and Eddie, if you don't know about our podcast. I felt like a dripping tap last year. And this year, I'm just going to open the floodgates and just go for it. Go for it. Try not to think about stuff too much. Try not to procrastinate. Try not to worry. Just fucking, ooh, swap. I want the YouTube. I want the YouTube dollar. Yeah, just try and enjoy it, mate. And just put content out into the world that I, I enjoy making. Because I love this stuff, mate, genuinely. And I love geeking out and talking drums and talking everything about drums. Everything that surrounds it, you know. Um, and, look, and snare drums. 
so yeah all right mate let's hop over at the kit and we'll see we'll see what we're saying um yeah all right people speak to you in a bit does anyone else do that every time you stand up you stand on the lead and then the headphone jack comes out and then you've got to buy another one it's really cool isn't it it's really cool i like it when you have to buy stuff you've already bought very kill cool. very kill cool, kill cool, kill cool. timer five minutes bash four minute 56 Here we go. That is an exercise that I did. I've been doing for years. I've taught it many times. It's, uh... that's all singles. And then you do the same, but incorporate doubles in the, so you go double, double, right, left. So kind of like a flammy sort of vibe. So you're going from singles into doubles within that sort of pattern. It's a good one, mate. That's a cheeky one, that's a five. Right, right, left, left, right. Left, left, right, right, left. And then... And then two singles. Right, left at the end, sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm trying my best. Right. <laughs> that's spicy. I've done that before. I remember that's uh, that's how I kind of practice most exercises. I try to just incorporate them into grooves. Do you know what I mean? Let me try that again. That's that's tricky though. I'm, I may muck up.
Time is up, mate. That's the timer. Five minutes in the bank. That's all you need to do, mate, really. Do you know what I mean? A quick hit workout. But yeah, I'm going to work on the... I haven't done that in ages, that exercise. I'm going to teach that in the Patreon page as well. Um, right, right, right. Um, sorry, right, right, left, left, right. Left, left, right, right, left. So you're leading with the right, then the left, obviously. And then... One, two, three, four. Four times. And then on the fifth one, you do a right, left at the end. And then what you can really do to spice that up is play that with singles as well. So instead of double, double, right, double, double, left, you can go single, single, right. So right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. That's really hard. Yeah, sick. Oh, I just don't want to stop playing. Sick. All right, that's, got, that's what I'm going to work on. Time is up. Thank you so much for tuning in, liking and subscribing and all that good stuff, mate. I'm going to be doing these every few days. I'm going to be probably uploading twice a week. Thank you so much for watching. Please check out my Patreon page if you want more of this. I'm going live every single week in here on my Patreon page in this format. So yeah, man, have fun in the kit. It's the most important thing. Remember that it's the most important thing. Fun equals progression. Fun equals more time in the kit. That equals getting better. That equals becoming the drummer that's in your head. Thank you so much for watching, mate. Have a good one. Have fun on the kit. Have fun in life. See you in a couple days.